Okay, so right here with me, I have the MTN 5G broadband. Now, this is the broadband everyone has been talking about because of the internet speed and all that, which is actually the current design of the 5G MTN broadband. So we are going to be unboxing it together and we are going to review it together and I will show you guys what this is all about, if it's really worth it or not. So you can see that I just purchased this. I opened it because I wanted to test it to see what's going on with it. Now, there is two price to this particular broadband, okay? Okay. you have to watch out for it now the first price is on the MTN official website which is 80,000 naira and uh, where I purchased it the person working at the MTN office who buys and sells to customers because there is no 5G in my own city or in my own state we don't have 5G yet so let's open this and see what we have because I actually ended up buying this extra 15,000 which is like uh, 95,000. The person actually wanted to sell it for 100,000, but 95. So inside here, the first box, we have the cable. You can see this. This is the internet cable. Now, I don't know why MTN is still doing this because my, uh, my laptop has type C, which this is not included. I don't know where this internet cable, they should have something that we can be able to put in a MacBook and stuff like that. The world is elevating. This is no longer needed. So another thing we have inside here is the charger. All right. You can see that this is a charger, just like the 4G broadband charger. So I was using the other 4G. I think I'm going to be using the power bank and the charger as well. So that's everything inside of this place. Okay. So this... This particular carton, we have the power bank. There's nothing else here. This is the power bank. It doesn't have on and off or stuff like that, just like the 4G. When you plug it, it starts working. When you unplug it, it stops working. Okay, so this is actually the big guy, the 5G power bank. Now, when I seen a lot of videos on the internet, I was thinking that this is actually big, but trust me, this is not big, okay? It's not big, it's not heavy. So I think this is the redesigned or stuff like that. I don't know, but it looks absolutely nice and clean, okay? It has the opening, I think, for the air and all that stuff on top of it. So this is really fine. It's really clear. So I can't be able to turn the back, but I can show you what we have over here. We have the phone connection. I don't know what that means. The internet cables connection and all that. I'm absolutely not going to be using any of these. I don't know what it is. And now over here, we have the, the signals, right? We have the network, we have the signal, we have the Wi-Fi and the power. So I think this is 4G, 5G or whatever. So I'm going to be showing you guys in the other videos for you to see how it works. And we are going to be testing the internet speed as well. So stick around in the video to the end, okay? We have this. You know the MTN, they will give you the manuals. So that's the only thing we have over here, the manuals. And uh, over here, the manuals as well. Let's go and all that. There is nothing more here. And that's absolutely all we have inside this place, okay? That's absolutely all we have. So we are going to be testing this out. Let's see the internet speed. Now, I'm going to be telling you guys if this is going to be worth buying or if you should buy the... 5, the 4G. Now remember, my state doesn't have 5G yet. I'm hoping that we're going to have it in the future, but we don't have it yet. But I bought it in case if I travel to a place they have 5G, right? I can enjoy it. Or if the 5G actually comes in my own state, because I know I'm not going to buy anything other, any other thing else, because I heard a lot of stories about the uh, the Elon Musk network and all that. I'm not going to put my money into that. I hope this will actually work. So let's test start the internet speed and let me tell you guys what we have, okay? Okay, so let me show you guys where you can be able to add the SIM card. Now remember, this SIM card can be able to work on your phone because I've been using the one I used to use on my MTN 4G broadband. And this SIM card, there is any SIM card of MTN can be able to work on this, trust me. It works 100%, so it doesn't matter the SIM card. They might write it 4G ready, but if you're in 5G zone, it can be able to show up. So this is where the SIM card is, okay? You can see here, this is where the SIM card is. You open over here, 
Yeah. You see the SIM card slot? That's where you add the SIM card, okay? I think it's on nano SIM or stuff like that. That's the SIM card slot over there. Uh, this is the phone and the USB-C, which I never know what this is all about, okay? So that's it over here, right? Okay, so right here, I have connected the power bank. You can see it over here. I'm using my 4G power bank to power this, okay? As the 5G power bank is still charging, I want it to be full before I can use it, but I just want to make this video and show you guys. So I will turn it on over here. That one doesn't touch it. You can see the power is on right now, okay? I hope this power bank can be able to power it anyways. This is my 4G adapter power bank. I just hope it can power it. Now, another thing I want to do is to buy the... There is a USB adapter they are selling right now that you can be able to use it. Okay, it's powering it. There is network is on now, right? Boom, the signal is there. Uh, I don't know what the light means, but I'm going to read it from the manual to see. Uh, I think the network is on. But one should not be able to be showing. You can see what's going on. The power is on. The Wi-Fi is on. The network is over there. So the signal is there. One light should not be showing. One light should be the 5G or stuff like that. So I don't know why all these lights is showing, right? MTN, what's going on? You guys should be able to write 4G or 5G. Okay, I think one light is off, which shows that the 5G is not available, right? So this is what we have here. Let's go check out the internet speed, okay? I think you guys really want to see this, all right? I hope you can see it clearly now. Let's test. All right. Mm -hmm. This is still the download speed. So we still have about 35, 30. Mm, yeah, that's 34. We have 34 on the, on the download speed. Now, the upload speed is a very big issue. MTN, what's going on? Now, I don't know if it's from the place I'm leaving, Abia State. I don't know what's going on. The network speed is crazy. Sometimes you can get up to, I think in the afternoon when I was testing it, I was getting up to about 15 to 20 upload speed, right? Maybe when I test it out later in the night or in the morning, you can get up to 25 uh, megabyte per second upload speed. And right here, you can get up to 50 and all that. So it depends on the timing and all that. So. That's really crazy over here. So this is what we have. And tell me if you are going to buy this, if you think this MTN 5G is really worth it, or if this is 4G renewed to be 5G. Mm. Let's wait and see what happens, all right? Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and catch you guys later.